So the concept of leavening is kind of something from Baker's world, but in essence, it's also a concept of spirituality, that whatever you're going to provide for them in that agreed period of time within reason, again, a day and God forbid too, but really right now is the thing that people need most to know that the Lord is in you, is that you're lifting that person up in some way in their challenges, and you're not just enabling them to stay that way. The provision is obviously what you've agreed to do for them, and you're providing that to them, so that's the provision. So help spells this. In America, we have rights, and those rights are decide whether or not we want help from someone. And one of the rudest comments that people do intentionally when they're sent by their companies to be tested and assessed whether or not they're trustworthy with food or trustworthy with money, when a company president sends his HR manager a note and say, send so-and-so over here, which I'm not pleased with as an employee, to take some money to that guy over there that I've seen a million times on the streets. Describe him completely. Make sure he has seen the photograph, at least all that's a public photograph. It's not a private photograph. And that's sort of a temperamental issue with me because you really don't have the right to photograph me without my consent or permission. But make sure you describe him to a T where he sits, what he pushes, what he looks like, what he tends to wear, what his hair is like, and all that and that he sits in a chair sometimes just to be more comfortable than sitting on a bucket, which he used to do all the time for almost a year, and now his ass hurts. But that's not the point. The point is, and then you send that ridiculous employee to deliver. And that employee is supposed to be fed a line of what to say and say, my company, PepsiCo, has decided to give you this, and I hope you'll use it in good health. And we have no strings attached in this gift. But what some employees do is that they'll walk up and say something else. Or what some employees will do is they'll walk up and not give all the cash that they allegedly collected for that homeless person. And what some people will do is they'll take my program, collect all sorts of gift cards, and then they're just having a gay old time running around the community shopping. I've seen players do that in a cut shop. Pretty sure they did that on my little piece of paper I gave them. So isn't that marvelous that people will abuse the lie of helping someone and they'll help themselves to God's provision for other people.